Hi, it's Chris from Broken Stones here. Um, today we're going to be looking at how we set a personalised background within um, within Microsoft Teams. You were then probably aware um, that last week Microsoft released the ability um, to be able to change your background, but as of yet the only backgrounds you can choose are some standard ones uh, given to us by Microsoft. Though you probably notice my background in my current um, Teams call is a personalised background and I'm going to show you today how I have and managed to add that on there. And I will say at this stage, this is unsupported by Microsoft, so you do so at your own risk. Um, I am fairly sure that Microsoft will be adding this ability into Teams in a more user-friendly way um, within a short space of time as well. So the first thing um, we need to do is we need to um, create our background in the first place. And to do that, I'm gonna use uh, my version of Photoshop. Um, and I'm going to um, set my background up. When I've had a look at the backgrounds which Microsoft have got in use, they're all of a size 1920 by 1080 pixels, and they're all PNG graphics. So that's exactly um, what I'm going to um, create here as well, to then ensure that it is close as possible to what Microsoft has created. Um, so once I've got my background, I have then exported that into then a PNG file, uh, and I have uh, saved it locally on my desktop. And I'll jump over to that now uh, in here. Uh, and I've got my um, background uh, here. Uh, and all we need to do is we need to copy that background. And then the key place we're going to go to is if you go to a place called app data forward slash Microsoft forward slash Teams forward slash backgrounds forward slash uploads so we're going to get to app data Microsoft teams backgrounds uploads uh, and in that folder we're just going to paste our new background in there just like so um, you'll notice um, another couple which I previously uh, uploaded there uh, and now if we jump back to Microsoft teams down here um, what we'll do is we'll click the three little dots and we'll click show background effects and we've got all of the standard Microsoft backgrounds here and you notice right down at the bottom we have our new backgrounds this is the one which I've just uploaded and I'll simply click it and click apply uh, and then you'll notice around me no sorry that one and you'll notice around me that my background has now changed you'll notice that the text is mirrored and, and that we can't read it locally um, don't worry People that um, uh, um, people that see you um, within the web conference um, oh, will actually see that text um, the right way around. It is only you that sees it mirrored. Um, so that's a nice, simple way to be able to set your own personalised background within Microsoft Teams. And I'd expect um, within um, um, within a few weeks to see Microsoft build that functionality in, so we can simply upload a image um, image much easier. Uh, the main things. Remember to then remember are to make are to make sure that your background is 1920 by 10 by 1080 pixels. Make sure that it is a PNG file and save it into that app data Microsoft Teams backgrounds uploads folder. Um, hope you get on well and um, speak to you soon. Cheers.